what's up guys? So if there's a God we have a somewhat love-hate relationship with, is Helios, the God of the sun. We beg for his presence during the coldest winters, and we beg for him to go away during the warmest summers and the hottest summers. So that's what actually has inspired this video, was just how warm it's been today. So Helios is actually more than just the God of the sun. He is also the all-seeing, is what was said that nothing escaped the eye of Helios. And he was actually, if you remember Helios, that informed Demeter uh, where Persephone, what happened to Persephone when she was looking for her because he sees everything being up in the sky. And a lot, and everyone in ancient Greece would actually swear by Helios to tell the truth in, in what they had to say because he, they can't lie to Helios because he saw everything. So with all that said, on this warm day, that has me all sweaty. I was inspired to do a video in honor of God Helios, the sun, the bringer of life, the one that helps us see you know, on our day-to-day -day basis and helps plants grow and gives us actually nutrients that we need. Anyway, guys, this is the Orphic Kim to Helios. Hear me, blessed God, with the eternal eye, all-seeing, gold-shining titan, Hyperion, heavenly light, natural and enduring, sweet sight to all living things. On the right hand, the father of the dawn, on the left, the night. You hold the mixture of the seasons, and your four hoofed steeds dance swift afoot with a rushing noise. Fiery, cheerful charioter, you ceaselessly drive the endless turning path through the sky. You guide the worship of ones to goodness, and give your rage to evil. Your golden lyre holds up the harmonic cosmic course. Leader of good works, youthful attendant to the season's turning, the world's ruler, you play the pipes, trailing fire in your wake, revolving in a circle, bringing light, all shining, life bringing, fruitful paean, always young, undefiled, father of time, Deathless Zeus, clear, shining on all, the eye that runs around the world, quenching the light, and then shining forth your beautiful rays. You guide us to justice, water-loving Lord of the world, guardian of the truth, ever the very highest aid of all. Eye of justice, light of life, O horseman, with cracking whip you drive the four horses of your chariot, and hear my words, and show a pleasant life to these initiates. So just a little cool side bit of trivia about Helios is that there was once the Colossus of Rhodes, which some of you have seen was one of the seven wonders of the world back in the ancient days. And it was a giant statue of Helios. It was 108 feet tall and roughly the size of the Statue of Liberty is today. So you can only imagine in the ancient roads, in ancient roads, how amazing and very complicated that must have been to write and make. Uh, definitely an amazing feat. And sadly though, it was leveled by an earthquake um, and that's what brought it down. It wasn't really people that like knocked it all down, but it was an earthquake that destroyed it. But interesting enough is that recently, as of 2008, there were some people that were interested in rebuilding it. So there is interest in the modern day to once again have the statue of Helios um, and a recreation of the Colossus of Rhodes. So we'll see one day in the future if that project ever does happen or if someone else picks it up, but it will be interesting to see. Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you later and um, keep thinking on the gods.